his reaction, I guess, will be limited until he's actually out. You know, uh, he's still in jail, but he knows that we, we made a lot of headway today. I mean, coming into this, you said you didn't even think you had a chance. You thought this I, was a dog and pony show. But... Pretty much, pretty much. I, you know what? Um, I can only say that the judge, the judge did the right thing. She's smart. She's intelligent. She's compassionate. And I think that uh, Mr. Cramsey carried the deck. You know, uh, up until this time, everybody seemed to think that this man was a vigilante and he was a crazed individual. I think it was important for the judge to meet him and see him for who he was. I think now we've made a lot of headway in terms of trying to get this resolved. A lot of the people in the press, you know, set him out as a vigilante. He's not that. Yeah, he's a man who's hurt. He's a man who lost a daughter, who's trying to get through his own grief by helping others. And those people were there because he has helped them. Um, the soldiers, the, the veterans that wrote that letter and affidavit to the court, um, they did it because he has helped them. This is not a man of violence.